Welcome to another riveting edition of the Part-Time Preppers. Let's go silver tubing. Yes, indeedy, we are back and uh, gonna do some silver tubing. Uh, did my own brake job. I've been doing my own brake since I was about 30 and decided to treat myself in labor to get some silver. We haven't gotten a lot lately. So went to local coin dealer. And first of all, Lady Liberty, if you're watching, there, went to my first estate sale probably in eight months. It's been a while, uh, a local and got there late. But got some really neat Disney glasses. There's Pocahontas. 50 cents for two of them. That was the only thing. Uh, there wasn't much there. But maybe we'll get me and the hand model back into the estate sale stuff. But okay, now. Uh, silver tubing. Uh, I, we like to do tubes. Uh, we have a tubes going at all times. Silver, dimes, quarters, halves. This is Silver Eagles. And these have been neglected for a while. They haven't been anything put in there in a while. And a mix roll of Peace and Morgan's doing a mixy. There's a couple pieces there on the bottom. So went to local coin dealer. And I, I like to cherry pick. Uh, I, a lot of you guys and girls get great deals online. Epmex, JM, Providence, whoever. You know, you get your rolls. Maybe you have eBay bucks, whatever. You get them for a spot or close to spot. I still love to cherry pick. So most of the time, well, I've never ordered any... Uh, constitutional, you know, just plain calls online, but I'm a cherry picker, so let's start. I bored you enough. Three American Silver Eagles, 18 bucks a piece. Eh, not the greatest. I mean, silver's like 14 70 hovering around $15. Uh, and two worn, worn, I tell you, call, mortgage. I'll get to them in a second. Let's do the Eagles first. So that was Saturday, so let's do the Eagles. I still, even then, she had quite a few. I love the cherry picker. Your first year, we're gonna have the first year in this tube of eagles, and uh, they do bounce around. I try to stay away from the. She'll have a few with nicks and scratches, but that was a nice winner, I thought. So that'll go in the tube, and I think there's about five or six in there now. And a 2002, I try to get the nice looking ones. 18. Okay, yeah, this last one I may keep. I may put it in a capsule. It may survive the tube just because I hope you can pick it up. It had the cutest little toning on it, and it's right on the date. And it was funny. It was like she read my mind. I'm looking at it. She goes, doesn't it have some neat toning? And that what I, I was thinking that kind of highlights the day, 2012. Wasn't that the year we're all supposed to like expire or something? Wasn't there a movie? Maybe I got the year wrong. Tell me if I'm wrong. But there it is. I like it. It doesn't pick up. There's a little bit of blue in it. So I don't know. And it is nice. The reverse is nice. I may put this. This might, this might go in a capsule. Uh, there you go. There's the reverse there. So we'll see about that one. And the two call Morgans. Okay. Plain Jane. 86. Nice and... Yeah, nice and smooth. I put it down CCT slide, took a slow ride, just a plain Jane there. Now the second one, and she had a big box. She got a nice load in, and I, I went through them rather quickly. Another plain Jane 85. But is it? Is it? Oh, this one's got a mint mark. It's an 85S. Not the rarest of Morgans, but a slightly better uh date with the mint mark there 85s um to me hey 25 all day long on ebay for this coin not that i'm gonna flip it but i'll put it in the tube somebody down the line will say "Ooh," if they know their stuff an 85s but there you go nice 85s so that was nice but i didn't have enough and i was in a hurry that day so i went back on tuesday let me find the receipt got three morgans couldn't couldn't stay away from those morgans and, uh, and as you could see, a repair of some jewelry, which was reasonable. And a two cent. I finally can say I'm going to put my two cents in. And you'll get to that last. Um, okay, let's do the Morgans again. Now, what is special about this? Another 86. However, I dug through them looking around. 
And this might have been the best pickup right here because it's an 86. Let's see if it'll, if I can focus. 86S, yes. Under a million, I believe. Uh, and so this could go easily for 30, I think. Uh, I could be mistaken. But still, this one may not even make the tube. I may put this in a flip or, or a capsule. A little bit rarer date. And uh, yeah, so it pays. You're not going to get the rare dates very often with the big boys. And uh, like I said, not super duper rare date, but I had it made my day there. And then the next are nothing too special. The others, a 91, a little Scarface there. Uh, I love that old time black. They get black like that or tan sometimes. Yeah, 91 O. And uh, this partner, a 90. Oh, New Orleans, and I sent them all down CCT slide, and they wait checked out, and uh, so that was very nice. So yeah, I, you know, I, not that uh, I just love cherry picking, and I get a kick out of that. Sometimes you go and do nothing special, and maybe you buy one or two. Two cent, I put my two cents in. I don't know if this thing's gonna show up good. Let's take a look. Finally, yeah, I've been collecting since. You don't know one since Disco was in. Off and on and never ever got a two cent piece. And this one's sitting in our cabinet for uh, about the last three times I went. Never, it was just sitting there. No price on it. It's in the bottom of the cabinet like she threw it in. And um, 12 bucks, I don't really, I'm not a big penny connoisseur. I never have been. Uh, I do, we do collect our copper pennies, uh, 82 and below, and someday we'll roll them. I did roll some of them, but um, yeah, there it is. I love the date. It's 1865. Look at that. Yeah, right. Civil War, General Grant or Lincoln or maybe even Robert E. Lee had this in his hands. So yeah, I just love the history and a little bit of copper. Not wrong, a little bit of copper. And lastly, for sure, here we go. I'll show this off because... I was talking to someone about this. Yes, the ugly duck. There it is. Yeah, I got this. Uh, we got this oh, a while back, more than a month ago, month and a half ago with eBay bucks. We had some eBay bucks. I got this. I want to say Liberty Coins. I'm not sure. On their eBay store. Yeah, it came to like five bucks. How could you go wrong with the ounce of silver? And I just find it odd. I, it is odd. It doesn't really look uh, like an eagle there. It does look like a little duck. But um, I just like the whole idea of the coin. And you got to buy what you like, and I liked it. And the 2019, I, we may be picking up. That is a beauty with the with the sun rays or starburst eagle flying there. And there's Queenie. Got to give Queenie her due. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this little quick video. It wasn't as quick as I thought it would be. But there you go. That's it. Now keep stacking. Keep your chin up. Watch what you're spending, stay out of debt, work hard, try to get ahead. Be friendly to everyone you can be. Okay, that's it. Words of wisdom from the part-time preppers. Have a wonderful day or night. Bye-bye.